I'm Hannah and today we're going to talk about style icons. What are they and who are mine? Because I'm sure you're dying to know. <laughs> to me, a style icon or like style inspiration is someone who dresses really well all the time and you want to dress like them. So they kind of have this aspirational quality about them. The first style icon I ever remember having, you know, before I even like knew what a style icon was, was Cyndi Lauper. So I was a second wave 80s kid, which means I was born in the 90s. <laughs> and I remember seeing Cyndi Lauper in the movie The Goonies. I watched it in 1999 when I was eight years old. And I remember just becoming obsessed with all of her. I was like, I'm gonna grow up to be Cyndi Lauper. And then I did. No, I didn't. <laughs> but since then, I've expanded my reach of style icons from movies uh, to TV shows, magazines, most recently we have style influencers and fashion bloggers and stuff online. So I'm going to share with you a few of my celebrity style icons and then a few of my online fashion influencers that I really admire. The first style icon I have is Nicole Richie because I have been obsessed with her style for years. And I think that's why I like her, because I've been following her style for years. You know, she's got hits, she's got misses, I like a lot of her outfits. But the fact that I'm able to watch another woman go through a style evolution, I'm able to see every chapter of her life, that's really inspiring to me. Kind of gives me permission to try out all these different styles. Because in reality, no one is going to wear the same style for their entire life. And I think Nicole Richie is a really good example of that. Next up is Hilary Duff, who's also been on my list for forever. I love how classic her style is. Like, girl knows her way around a pair of denim. But then she'll surprise us with like a funky blazer or an oversized scarf. And it, it's just, it's so attainable. She's wearing things that anyone can wear. And I, I love that. Next is Rita Ora, who I think is really underrated. She's someone that you can just tell she's having a lot of fun with fashion. She's not afraid of playing with colors or prints or patterns or shapes. She just goes for it. She's very unapologetic, very kooky, very cool. I just love it. Then I want to highlight Jenna Lyons, who I don't know if she really counts as famous or she's just like famous by association because of her role in the fashion industry, but she has impeccable personal style. She does this thing where she'll take like a really simple clothing item, like a button up or a trench coat, and she'll dress it up all fancy. I don't even know what she's doing, but I really, I really aspire to have that bit of glam in my life every day. And the last celebrity I have is on every best dress list, and that's Solange. Like I could fill a book with all of the outfits that I've clipped from magazines that were hers. I think her secret is she takes really bold pieces and then tailors them to her body and that kind of takes away that overwhelming that comes from wearing something bold and that's how she gets away with wearing really risky things. So those are just a handful of the celebrity style icons I have and now I'm going to share with you some Instagrammers, fashion bloggers, online influencers, whatever you want to call them. First one is one of my thrift sisters, Dina of Dina's Days. So she has a really colorful style, but the thing that really sets her apart is she's very transparent about the process, like the process of getting dressed. She'll talk about where her clothes are coming from, how she puts together the outfit. And I think that's really important because not everybody comes out of the womb knowing how to get dressed. And she dresses so well, like she's really good at combining colors and she teaches you about them. Next is a fellow stylist, Melody Stewart, and I like that she's really good at high-low dressing. She's kind of creating her own street style. Like her outfits are a little sweet and a little edgy, but they always have a visual impact. I would be remiss not to talk about Tess of Safety Tess, who I actually met here on YouTube, and then I started stalking on Instagram. <laughs> um, her style is just really fun and really shiny. Is that a way to describe someone's style? It's shiny. She just inspires me to wear glitter and go-go boots every day. <laughs> Second to last is Brianna of Coming in Clutch. She has a really good eye for unique pieces, but then she styles them in practical ways. Like there's a recent outfit that she posted that I really liked and she's wearing this statement top and then she pairs it with overalls. Overalls. <laughs> Innovative. She just has such a cool girl style. Last but not least is Audrey of Affectionately Audrey because she can mix patterns like nobody's business. Like sometimes the mixes are a little out there, but I admire that she's going for it, trying it, and she's having fun with fashion. And those are the qualities I look for in style icons. 
And that's just a small sampling on my list. But now I want to hear from you. Do we have any of the same style icons? Is there someone that you think that I should know? Maybe an Instagrammer that I've never heard of or a celebrity that's really underrated? Tell me down in the comments. So with that, Thank you very much for watching. If you like the content that I create, then be sure to support it by following and subscribing and liking and commenting and sharing it with your friends because those things are really important not only to me but to all the creators. Hopefully I will see you around on the internet and in the meantime, be excellent to each other.